Hi viewers, welcome to Akshaya Vlogs and Crafts. Today I am going to say about uh, Sri Guru chapter 46 in English. Sri Guru visits 8 places at one time. At the time of Diwali festival, 7 devotes of Sri Guru came to Ganagapur Math and requested Sri Guru to come to their places for Diwali. As Sri Guru loved them all alike, it was a problem before him as to whose invitation should be accepted. Sri Guru said to them, You are all from different places. How can I come to your homes at the same time? You decide among yourselves as to where I should go first and where I should go later. Each devotee wished that Sri Guru should come to him first. So they could not decide and began to quarrel. Sri Guru called the devotees one by one and told each of them, I shall come only to one house, so don't argue unnecessarily. Then the devotees said, O oh Guru, do not make any distinction between the rich and the poor. Please treat us equally. If you neglect us, we shall end our lives. We serve you and we do whatever you say. With these words, they all prostrated themselves before him humbly. Thereupon, Sri Guru said, All right, I shall visit you all. Rest assured about that. One of the disciples asked him, How can we be sure that you will visit the homes of all of us? Then Sri Guru called each of them separately and said, I will come to your house, but do not tell others. All the seven devotees thereafter went back to their respective places, pleased. When the devotees of Ganagapur knew this, they requested Sri Guru, you should not go out of Ganagapur for Diwali. Sri Guru promised them also that he would be there and they need not worry. In the morning of Narak Chaturthasi day, Sri Guru took eight forms and went to seven places of seven devotees and also stayed at Ganagapur Math. He accepted puja in all the places. Later, the devotees gathered at Ganagapur for Dibaradhan on the Kartik Purnima, each one told that Sri Guru had been to him in Diwali and showed the cloth presented to him by Sri Guru. The people of Ganagapur said Sri Guru was here in the Math during Diwali. But on seeing the articles presented by Sri Guru, all realized that Sri Guru had taken eight forms in Diwali. And they were all amazed. The conviction that Sri Guru is the incarnation of three motis became more firm and they adored him with greater devotion. He who worships Sri Guru will have all his desires fulfilled. All try to experience the value of Guru Bhakti, but fools cannot appreciate Amrit. Only jnanis and devotees can relish the Amrit of Guru Nama. The Vedas and Shastras proclaim that he who looks down upon Guru as an ordinary human being will be born an animal. Sri Guru Charitra is equal to Veda Shastra. Only Guru can elaborate one from those throws of Samkara. Those who go to Kanagapur and serve Guru with devotion will surely get all their desires fulfilled. So listen, all of you, purify your mind and visit Kanagapur. That's all. Please support, share, like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you. Bye-bye.